All right, wanted to do a quick video here on the 740i Sport on uh, known flaws, blemishes, things like that. Get up close to the paint um, and just show you what it looks like. So it's a beautiful color, orient blue metallic. You can see the metallic flake really come out. Um, I think this is probably this, and I think it's Oxford green or whatever the green color is, is uh, probably the best to get in an E38. Um, so we'll just get up close to the car. You'll see it's definitely you know, driver quality. There's scratches on it, dings, which I'll try to point out. You can see some of the scratches here on the trunk. A little chip here. More scratches on this side. Little ding here. Little ding there. One down here. Little scuff here in the trim. Wheels and tires are in great shape. On a couple of the wheels, the clear is starting to come off and chip. You can see right there. One of them is worse than the others. Some scratches on the roof. This thing here, I don't know what that is. I've seen this in other BMW E38 options where they get this little swirl here. Um, chips, some chips on the mirror. Here. here, a little ding here it looks like, I don't know if you can see that. Same on the hood, um, you got chips, scratches, a couple dings. license plate to link it for the front license plate that'll come with the sale. This wheel's in really good condition. There's a little scratch here. This is the tire or the wheel that's probably a little bit worse off than the others from the clear standpoint. So it's just these little chips though. There's no scuffs or anything, but it looks like it's just the clear starting to chip. All right, we'll jump inside real quick. Little cracks in the wood grain there. Floors are in great condition. I have floor mats that'll be included too. A little wear here. Wear on the seat. Overall in really good condition though. There's a crack in here, if you can see that, and the armrest and the actual like plastic in there, not on the leather or anything. 
wood grain's in great condition here, and then a few cracks, it looks like, in the gear knob. Dash is in phenomenal condition. And so is the headliner. No issues at all with the headliner. I just had the seatbelt spring. You'll see service records for it uh, replaced. It was not retracting properly. So that's all done. And there's floor mats back here as well that are currently in the trunk right now. First aid kit is in there. I've got pictures of it. Uh, there's a little discolor here on the seatbelt. Trunk key works as expected. Got some stuff in here. CD player is out. Uh, I have the bracket for it. It'll be included in the sale. And then those are the floor mats that I was mentioning. like the screwdriver. And the legendary golf bag picture. Emblems are in great condition. We'll open up the store. I just washed it so Again, I have the uh, floor mats. A little crack here in the wood. And then this was the other non flaw So this is the uh, glove box latch. Right now I have a zip tie back here. If you can see it, that'll open the glove box. Um, but the latch does not work. So the key goes in and works and everything, but it doesn't actually open it. So um, the zip tie back there will actually open the glove box, but it's kind of rigged, obviously. And then passenger seat in really good condition. These tend to separate here. This one is not bad. I've seen much worse separating a little bit. But like I said, dash is in amazing condition. So is the headliner. And I really just think this blue, orient blue with a tan inside, um, just really pops. It's hard to see the color in some of the pictures. But hopefully you can hear, see it here from the video. It really is just a gorgeous, gorgeous color, especially with the M parallel wheels.